September 14, 2022, Ford unveiled the seventh generation of the Mustang, the S650. Now amongst this new lineup of stallions was the all new Mustang Dark Horse. Now, aside from its new bolt styling, the new Mustang S650 Dark Horse comes loaded with some high performance features. The Mustang Dark Horse is the most powerful, naturally aspirated 5.0 liter V8 Mustang ever. It delivers 500 horsepower and 418 pound feet of torque, thanks to the new fourth generation Coyote V8. That's 100 horsepower per liter. That's a lot. At 500 horsepower, this makes this new generation Mustang the most powerful to date aside from the Shelby models, which, as you know, are supercharged and they have the Godzilla motor. So how did they do it? Well, according to Ford, the Coyote engine was upgraded. The new engine features a uniquely balanced crankshaft, forged pistons, and connecting rods, strengthened camshafts, and a dual throttle body design, which is all new, and it breaks the mold of anything that Ford has done before. And the best part is a 7,500 RPM redline. But wait, there's more. It also comes with an auxiliary oil cooler, rear axle cooler, and a lightweight radiator to keep things cool when your driving is heating up. You see, these are the mods that make the Dark Horse a street legal street slash track car, and it's everything I've been dreaming of. All right, let's shift gears and talk about shifting gears. Dark Horse comes with a Tremec 6 speed or the 10 speed automatic. And let's not forget the drift brake. Yep, you can drift the Mustang right out of the box without having to add a bunch of extra weight and calibers and hardware. And if you did not see the unveiling of the S650 Dark Horse, the drift brake was a collaboration with multi Formula Drift champion, my boy. Bon getting Jr. So you know it's the real deal, holy feel. Another first from Ford is the offering of the carbon fiber wheels from Carbon Revolution on a non-Shelby Mustang. Gorgeous wheels, if you haven't seen them already, and stopping powers comes from the big six-piston Brembo brakes and the 13.9-inch rotors up front. You can stop on a dime and it'll even give you some change back. And check this out, dedicated cooling ducts, bigger sway bars, heavy-duty front shocks, lightweight strut tower brace and a K brace helps stiffen the stallion up and it rides on the Magna Ride adaptive dampener so you get the performance without sacrificing the ride quality. Now everything I mentioned is all in the name of handling but if you want to kick it up a notch Ford offers a handling package with more aero. Now this package gives you more aggressive spoiler, bigger sway bars and wider wheels. The cockpit sees some serious upgrades as well. A thicker flat bottom steering wheel and a 13.2 inch curved dual display are all new. And one of the features on the screen is being able to change the gauges from the previous generation of Mustangs. So like you, you can actually put Fox body gauges on your digital display, which is pretty neat if you ask me. As you can see, the Dark Horse is going to pack a serious punch, which is why I can't wait for them to arrive. Now, if you want to know when you can order one, then hit that subscribe button because once I know, you'll know. So let me know what you're most excited about in the 2024 Dark Horse in the comments below. Now, I know Mustang, two-seater there is a back seat but it's not a lot of room so if you're looking for a performance vehicle and you have a family to haul around check out this video on the 2024 bmw m3 ces until next time guys peace